Copying pieces or sliding parts around in sonar is easy enough, but it can be aggravating if they don't line up. Let me show you what you're likely to expect. Now here's a four bar drum pattern. Notice if I click on it to highlight it, it doesn't highlight all the way to the sixth bar, but only to the end of its notes. It selects right from the first of my clip because the first note is right on a downbeat. Let me show you how that will affect us. First I'll copy that piece. Then I'll place the cursor on the sixth bar and paste it there. I'll give it several repetitions so we can see the effect. I'll turn on click during playback. You see it pasted them back to back so it's gone way off tempo. Here's what to do instead. With your snap to grid turned on, drag along the timeline to select exactly four bars. Notice it included the empty spot at the end. Now again I'll copy that and I'll paste it again with its repetitions and you'll see this time it works. Now let's look at another example. I made a bass part, but it comes in ahead of the beat. Now when I select this one, notice it doesn't start from the first of the bar. Therefore, if I copy it over, it certainly won't line up. Again, the remedy for this Drag along the timeline and select exactly the bars you want. It's important to make sure only the track or tracks you want copied are highlighted. Now I can copy paste that or by holding down the control key I'll drag and drop. And now the timing comes in perfectly. Now let's look at this audio track. The way sonar handles audio is almost the same as MIDI. It becomes very flexible. Let's drag along the timeline and select four bars of the audio. I'll hold down control and drag and drop that. And if my audio performance wasn't right on the beat, I'd be concerned here I might have cut off this first note. By zooming in here, I can see we're still safe. If it were cut off, I could simply drag out the end to bring it back. Let me undo all those changes and go back to where we started. In this example, the bass is the only instrument that comes in ahead of the beat, so I'll select that first bar on the bass only and simply copy it over to the end. Now that makes it a lot easier. I can simply select four bars and select all the tracks I want to copy. I'll hold down the control key and slide the whole group over. Hope that helps. Have fun.